Well, if you ever tried to do a face swap using Gemini's Nano Banana, well, you are going to be disappointed because this tool will either ignore your request or just give you a really bad photo. So this is a non-problem in the Gemini community and basically this AI model won't give you or edit the photo at all. So even though you probably have found some videos on YouTube talking about how you can use Gemini to do a face swap, in a lot of cases, they're just giving you an example where you can replace the face with someone who is famous. And because they are famous, there is a good chance that the information or the face do exist in the Gemini training data, and therefore you can do the face swapping. But so far, I haven't found an example of someone replacing the face of a person using another photo with Gemini's Nano Banana. So far, it is just so difficult or not consistent or perhaps not possible. In fact, there is this answer from Google on this Reddit post about this particular issue and the response was just use a better prompt, but it just doesn't work. So many prompts I tried, so many hours I tried different methods to do a face swap using Gemini, but none of them is working. But then, eventually, I found a method to do a face swap quite reliably using Gemini's Nano Banana. So, this is the face, and I'm putting this face into this body, into uh, this guy's face, and this is the result. So maybe not the best looking photo, but it was done using Gemini. So I'm going to show you my method to do a face swap using Gemini's Nano Banana. Surprisingly, it is not difficult. It's quite easy, but there are a few things that you need to do beforehand. So for this example, I'll try to use this photo as a target. Let me just download this on my computer. And I guess I'm going to be using this gentleman's face again. So I'm going to put his face into this body. Now, after that, you can use tools like Canva or Microsoft Paint or Photoshop. I think Photoshop is a bit overkill, but you know, just use any tool that allows you to cover the face with uh, some sort of shape like oval or circle it's up to you now since I'm, I'm using windows i'm using i'm going to be using the microsoft paint tool let me just drag and draw the photo right here so we have to cover the face with a marker or a color and i'm going to be using this tool and i will select the field setting to be solid color the color will be red for both outline and the inside now I'm going to just cover this face with the red color. Okay, let me just use the tool. Yeah, this might take what some time depending on the size and how nice and tidy you want to edit or cover the face or maybe the entire head. But that's basically it. You just would have covered the face or the head of the person. And after that, just save the photo. And I'm going to minimize this program. Now we can go to Gemini. All right, let me just drag and drop the new red face photo like that. And after that, we can upload the other photo, which in this case, the Asian guy that I want to put into this body. Now, how about the prompt? Well, you can use this AI prompt. Let me just copy it. And if you are interested, I'm going to provide this prompt in the description down below. Click tools, click create images and send a message. So the problem is actually not very long. Usually when I'm showing you a tutorial using Gemini, there's going to be very long prompt, but this is surprisingly very compact prompt. And that should be enough to uh, tell Gemini that you want to replace or put this, this face into uh, this body and do some lighting or skin color adjustment. And by the way, that's also a great point because you probably don't want to put the face of someone with vastly different skin color. It's just not looking great. So we want to get someone uh, or two people with slightly similar skin color and that should be fine. But if it's very, very different, then I don't think it's going to work. Anyway, uh, we, we're still waiting. And there it goes. So now we got that guy's face. Now with a slightly different color, I have to admit, but that's the consequence of doing the face swap using Gemini. But still, I would say it looks great. Uh, we are able to put 
this man into this gentleman's body i think it looks decent it looks pretty good so yeah i would say this is one method that you can try to do a face swap using gemini let me know what you think in the comment down below thanks so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video have a great day